Hello guys, welcome back to Lan app. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you reconvert upsell tutorial for Shopify. So if you're interested, let's get started. So you might be wondering what is reconvert upsell here? How do you start using how do you integrate it in your Shopify store? There are going to be a few things that we need to discuss here. First, let's start with discussing what is reconvert upsell. So Reconvert Upsell and Crossell here is a Shopify app that helps you make more money after someone places an order and yep, post purchase upsells. Now think of it like this, uh, your customer just bought something, they're happy and right at that moment, Reconvert pops up with an additional offer that feels super relevant. Like, hey, want to add this matching item for 20% off, in this case is quite easy. Now, what's cool is that Reconvert gives you a drag and drop builder to customize your thank you page, aka the order confirmation page. Now, you can add upsell, cross sales, birthday collectors, surveys, reorder buttons, and tons of stuff. But it all looks slick and matches your store style. Now, even better, you don't need to be tech genius here or savvy, and you can just set rules like if a customer buys a product, a offer or offer product B or if their card total is over $50, show this upsell. Now, it's all about targeting the right product to the right person at the right time. Now, the best part, these upsells happen after checkout, so there's no friction. The customers already bought something and the, up, and the upsell is just one click away from being added to their order. So if you're looking to increase your average order value without being pushy, Reconvert is a solid tool here. But yeah, so in this case, how do we install, how do we set up upsell here or reconvert upsell? Well, first things first is you want to go ahead and go to Shopify store. So go to Shopify.com, log in into your account and access your store. Now, since we want to install the app reconvert upsell, we need to access the Shopify app store. Now, at the bottom left, you want to go and click on settings. And in here, you want to go and click on apps and sales channel. Now, from here, you want to go and click on the Shopify app store at the top right here. And from here, we want to go ahead and just enter reconvert. Let's just type in reconvert upsell. And from here, you should be able to see the app. Let's go and click on it. Now, just to give you some idea here, the great thing about reconvert uh, upsell and cross sell here is you can actually use this for free. Now, it is available for development stores here. They have A and B testing, the checkout editor, and one-click upsell and post-purchase funnel editor, thank you page editor, and all other features. Now, obviously, if you get the upsell basic, upsell premium, or upsell premium pro here, you get more out of the store itself. Now, as you can see, it's highly rated here. It's like with a 4.9 uh, rating with up to 5K people using it. Let's go and click on install. Now from here, it should open up another tab, which in this case, you just need to confirm that you really want to install this. Let's go and click on install. Now from here, what we need to do next is we just need to follow the on-screen steps or the instructions that we'll be seeing on our screen. So just wait for it. And as you can see, we've just installed it. Now it's going to load up a few things for us to get us started here. So first it's going to say, boost your revenue in minutes, not months here. Now, in this case, uh, you have like a bunch of things that you could do here. You also have the start free trial now. So in this case, it allows you to basically start your free trial for reconvert. Now, once you click on the uh, start free trial here, it's going to say you will be billed for this app when you uh, when you begin use it. These charges will appear on your monthly invoice and your threshold bills, which in this case, uh, this is going to be uh, your, um, in this case, your a free trial here let's go and click on approve so that we could start using it and uh, in this case it's going to say uh or in this case it's going to load up the next page here let's just wait for it to load up and yeah so it's going to welcome you into reconvert now from here you have the option to enable the post purchase uh post purchase option the thank you page here and order status page here now from here it, you, ha you also have the uh, please choose max discount value that you could offer here so let's just say uh since i'm just starting out let's just say like 20 percent let's go and click on get started now from here we let's just wait for this to load up now from here it's going to ask you to do a few things now you could add reconvert to your thank you page here so in this case you just need to go to your settings check out customize check out then thank you let's go and click on click here 
Now from here, it should open up a new tab, which in this case, what we need to do is we want to add a few things here. So you can see there are going to be slots that we could use here. So for example, for the thank you page, just go and click on the plus button next to it. And it's going to click on thank add to thank you. It's going to be automatically added for us, as you can see from here. And once it's actually added, what you could do is you just need to click on save at the top right here. And it's now saved. And you just need to go back in here, click on check status just to see if it's actually added. So it's going to say detected. Let's go and click on next. And from here, it's going to say add or convert to your order status page. Let's go and click on click here. And by the way, same thing. You need to add it. Let's just wait for it. So you want to go and scroll down a bit here. You have your order status page. Let's go and choose the custom slot here. Click on the plus button. Click on order status. And from here, just click on save at the top right. And let's go and go back into our store here. And let's go and click on the check status. And it should say detected. Let's go and click on next. Now from here, it's going to say almost there. Add reconvert to your post purchase page. Now same thing. Let's go and click on click here. And from here, what we need to do is we want to go ahead and basically just scroll down a bit until you see the post purchase page. Let's go and click on reconvert. And let's go and click on save at the top right, a uh, top section here. And when it's actually saved, let's go and go back here, click on check status, and it's going to say reconvert. Let's go and click on finish. Now, once you've done that, we just set up or basically just set up your uh, reconvert app into your Shopify store, which is something quite simple here. Now, once in the app itself, this is what, or in this case, you should be to see your dashboard, which includes your flows, your revenue, accepted offers, and just basically the general information here on how your store is performing. Now, you also have the social automation on the left side here. So these are your tools that you can access, which in this case, uh, you need to uh, basically uh, try it first uh, for like the hard and air powered social media marketing team. But yeah, let's go back to our left side here. Click on activity report, which in this case gives you information on the activity that happened uh, in your store. And you also have the referral program here if you want to join that. So you have a few link here, people email setup here, and visitors referrals or the only earnings here. And also have these settings here, which allows you to change a few things like the application status here. Now you can disable reconvert. You can also set up your language, your order settings here, multi-location inventory as well, and order action here. So in this case, you can tag orders with upsell generated by reconvert. Now, if you want to view the pricing for it, you can go and click on help and pricing here. And you should be able to see some help or articles here that could help you on using the app. Now, if you want to edit the actual UI for your reconvert upsell, uh, widgets here, what you need to do is you want to go to online store at the left side. You want to go to teams and you want to go and click on customize. And first you want to visit the actual pages. So at the very top here, I want to go and click on homepage. Let's go and choose the cart or checkout customer accounts here as well. Now from here, it's going to give you a bunch of information here that includes the checkout and it should also load up the actual um, widgets that we have. So let's go and switch over to the thank you page as an example here. From here, as you can see, it is reconvert. You can go and click on edit slot here. And from here, what you need to do is go and click on the edit slot again. It's going to say app embed page here. It's going to click on OK. And it should open up the actual editor, which in this case, uh, you should be able to start changing a few things. Or in this case, you should be able to start building or your flow, which in this case allows you to specify how things are going to look like or go what are going to be the things that will be happening here. Now, as you can see, you could basically add like products here, like your ad blocks and widgets, which is kind of similar here with Shopify's editor. So yeah, you can go and click on ad block here, add your success error banner, you can add a widget here, either a text divider or a product. So yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So those are the basics that you need to know in order for you to get started here with reconvert. So the great thing about reconvert here is they have a bunch of tutorials or further details on how to do a, few, uh, a lot of things here, like a help video here in the flow builder as well. But yeah, so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to your lineup. Thank you for watching.